WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, we've got about a, a mixed bag out here. That mixed bag has the Dow off 54. The S&P is up 2. NASDAQ is flat. Russell 2000 is up 18. Nothing flat there. Semi is off 32, about 8 tenths of a percent. Trend is off 45, about 3 tenths. New York Stock Exchange is higher. The Wilshire is higher. Spot Volatinix is falling. It's uh, going to go tag that 50 day exponential moving average. We'll take a look at that during the trade. Well, actually, we'll take a look at that during the market update here. Gold's up 70 cents. Silver's back 9 pennies. In fact, let's go straight to our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES minutes in our upper left hand corner. You can see that price has uh, not hit exactly the top of that daily profile but close enough to it the top is at the 4717 level the high today is 4712 so five ticks away five points away uh 20 ticks uh before price would target that level the uh s&p or the es mini is not going to go much lower not this stage not until we see what happens as the uh, spot volatilics tags that 50-day exponential moving average. Currently, the spot is trading at 2070. The 50-day is trading at 2034. If you get a close below 2034, that suggests that the ES Mini will take out that TAS market profile daily resistance level and shoot all the way up to the top of the weekly profile at the 4740 level. The NQ is back at resistance as well. In fact, all four of the equity future contracts are testing the top of their daily profile. The top of the daily profile inside the NQ is 16,456, and the high today is 16,436. If we take a look at the U.S. dollar, still just consolidating with inside its daily profile, close below 95.64, which suggests a further move lower. That is support. Goldilocks just trading sideways, as is silver, so nothing really to explore there. You've got the uh, light sweet crude is uh, testing the resistance level at the top of its profile. 72.51 is the profile. It's trading at 72.59 right now. Natural gas has a little bit of a bounce going on. There is a new profile that's attempting to form with support at $3.78. Uh, what we don't have is any kind of bullish reversal signal to suggest a buy the D point pattern is in. And if the 30 year treasury can close below 162.27, that's the center of its bearish structure daily profile, that'll suggest to move down to the bottom. And that's at 161.02. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. But if you're off to start your Wednesday, we want you to have a wonderful one. Thanks so much for joining us. And we'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care.